Triceratail. And a dinosaur egg. Well, that'll make a nice profit. By the way, in case you missed it the first time, I'm gonna put it up again. Okay, you got it. Alright, now, before we head to the next shop, which will be the last stop on the tour, we go, we're gonna take the rest of the tour here. Alright, let's see. Well, this is the train station. When I travel to the other city, which I'll tell you about now, the, na the name of the city is Quick City, spelled C-W-C-C-I-T-Y. We'll visit there later, but not by train, of course. It'll be, uh, ho it'll be uh, run by the uh, character named Crystal, C-R-I-S-T-A-L, when we get there. All right. Oh, look at this, a hole in the ground. Yeah, you see, sometimes so there's an item in Quick City. I don't have it here in Quickville, because I had Quickville a lot longer than Quick City. I bring stuff from Quick City over here. Because obviously I did not collect this one yet. I got a good memory. And also, you know, I got a good taste for music because I grew up on music. So anyway, yeah, let's move on. With oh, you notice this? You know why this is here? I paid my deck. And this is Sanchi's mug again, right next to the master. Oh, look at this. HFA. A pair of mean eyes. Must mean something bad. I know what it means. I'll tell you about it at the end of the documentary here of the city of Quickville and Quick City. Or otherwise, all the deal in Animal Crossing for Nintendo GameCube in a nutshell. So, anyway, here's the post office. Do my mailing and such. And the e reader swipes. By the way, there's a good way of profits from the e reader. I'll tell you about that in Quick City. Oh, wait, no. A money spot. I'll just dig up the thousand bells. Yep, thousand bells. Just bury that up. And drag it up there. Use the R button to uh, quickly pick up the items. Anyway, here's the dump. I come here first, pick up the whatever items are here every time I start Animal Crossing. Hmm, got a shirt. What we got here? A plant. I have picked up a Pothos before, so I know it's a plant. I don't really use plants in my house, you know, except for that Christmas tree, but that's because, you know, it's the holidays. But anyway, she's around here. I want to show you my favorite character that I kind of got to know it from the start. Oop, she just went in. So let's go say hello. Yeah, um, um, could you come out here, please? Mm, darn it, I can't see her, but anyway, uh, I think you recognize her. Oh, here we go, a little bit. Yeah, Mint. She's a sweetie. She gave me a birthday present on my 21st birthday when I time traveled back. Talk to me. The way it's bit. It's November. Yeah, I got a heater in the basement. Huh. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Well, I'll see you there, Minty. You're a sweetie. Anyway, let's uh, also, on the trip, we'll take a look at some of the other colorful characters we have around here. Also, every time I uh, keep a track of the uh, map, see if anybody new came in. Oh, we got a new neighbor, Bertha. I hadn't noticed her before, so she's obviously new. So anyway, uh, let's move on. Here's another character I grew up with. Actually, she moved in and but lived here most of the time, Marcy. You know she's wearing a Sanchu shirt. Sanchu is very popular in Quickville. There's Anna Cootie. She just went in. And there's Elmer. He just went in. He was one of the senior citizens around here, too. I say that because he was lived here. Huh? By the way, our, ne our uh, city pe fruit is a peach. Well, I've grown a lot of orange pears and such. Oh, well, you know, it's that girl from the train. I have to draw her face every time, but when I'm in a hurry, I just color it, the whole thing, and she looks like a blank face. But I gave her a face last time. Oh, there was another character up here on the hill. And she just came out, Shaver. Well, you know, she's wearing Elmer's clothes. Anyway, moving on with the tour. Well, <laughs> good joke. 
Anyway, also, you know, I like to use the billboards for my signs up. There's my Sanchi site logo. There's Sanchi's mug. I got two here side by side, represent the uh, holiday and uh, such. You know, we got your corn that you got from the previous issue. And I drew this leaf. Obviously for Thanksgiving and the Harvest Festival. Oh, look, there's Groucho. He's wearing the Sanchi side shirt. Let's say hello. There, Tammy. A fruit, huh? I'll, I'll take one. Yeah, it makes a nice little profit when you talk to them. And most of the time it happens in the jobs. So anyway, yeah, here's Leopold. He moved in a long time. Here's Hank. He was one of the senior citizens around here also. But as always, Mint and Hank. Mint and Elmer. Let's go say hello to the new neighbor. Oh, yeah, here she is. She must be Bertha. Hello, Bertha. It is a nice place. You're <laughs> scared, brain. Yeah. Okay, we'll see you around. Here's the museum. Let's go look at the exhibits. First, we'll look at the bug exhibit. I got most of the bugs. I'll show you. This is my bug collection. I caught them all one by one, then donated them one by one. Want to see my number of fish? Not as much. But anyway, uh, all the bugs are just running around here. Well, you know, we got a couple of few bugs on the trees here. Two of them are fighting. Oh, that's funny. Like Lucy and Desi. I love Lucy. Anyway, uh, to the next exhibit, the fish exhibit. Yeah, you can see here, I caught those fish. And I donated them. Mm, this one's empty. I guess it's waiting for a kind donation. Yeah, here's a bunch of fish. Here's some more fish. One fish, two fish. Red fish, blue fish. Alright, anyway, moving on with the tour of the museum. Take a look at the paintings. I haven't gotten them all yet, but uh, I got a few. Here's a nice one. It's strange, though. So I guess why you call it a strange painting. Yeah, some of them are, most of them are just waiting for a kind donation. But I got this one from a swipe. Your uh, common painting from old boots. But my favorite painting around here is uh, right here. Washington crossing the Delaware. But you guys call it the classic painting. Anyway, moving on. We're going to check out what I worked hard for and actually got done. The fossil section. All the fossils right here. All of them. Dug them all up. Though the last one I completed and the last one I picked up was the pterodactyl. All I needed was the right wing and I completed the pterodactyl as well as the fossil exhibit. And who's my favorite? It's obvious. Anyway. Oh. You can actually see the bug in that amber, you know that? Right there. Wonder what kind of bug that is. I think it was in the uh, insect thing. Oh well, forget. Anyway, moving on with the tour. Leaving the museum. See you later, sleeping blathers. Oh, here's another neighbor, Cookie. She just went in. Alright. Well, anyway, uh, since we're uh, down here, I'm going to tell you a couple of things. This is the top. Here's the dock right here. And there's the sea turtle. Of course, uh, I usually would check around the uh, beach lines for old Gulliver, that sailor bird. You should have called him Pelipper, like the Pokemon. You notice these two signs here? You need Game Boy Advance to get started. But when you come back, welcome to the GameCube. But anyway, let's go visit the island real quick. Because I'll show you something fun you can do on the island. I use my Game Boy Advance SP, but I do have a GBA as well. So I use the uh, SP for, uh, you know, with the e-reader because, you know, my Digimon players, it's uh, easier to hold and swiping as 
as compared to the uh, GBA original. Anyway.